Greetings to all of my new subscribers, my family, and what's up, uh, YouTube, for this platform. So, guys, thank you, thank you, thank you very much. I'm gaining subscribers, so I must be doing something right. I really appreciate you. So, what we're going to do today is we're doing a little bracelet, talking about some bracelets today. Okay, this is Sunbon Creations. So, first off, guess what? I did a video. It was like 15 to 16 minutes, and guess what? Guys, I was out of the frame with some of my uh, pieces. So, I'm like, I can't do that. I cannot put that video out. But anyway, long story short, let's get into it. What you think? Right now, this is a one of a kind. It can be imitated, but it'll never be like this. I love this combination. Who would have thought to put this combination together? Your sailor blues, your grays, your bronze, mixture, your green ocean colors, two different types of colors there, guys. And I used a white uh, spacer bead because with beads like 12 meals, you need to put a bead in between. Because if you don't, it's going to gap and it's not going to look right. You got your amethyst here. And you got your purple there. This is gorgeous. And I got to hurry up with this, guys, because my battery uh, just flashed. One of a kind, guys. Isn't that gorgeous? This is going on my Shopify website, guys. I'm getting it ready. So we're moving very, very quickly. Now, let's go to... This is a little bit different. I got these green and black beads out of Hobby Lobby. This is a stretch bracelet, guys. And I got this loaded down with uh, quartz crystals. I have a quartz crystal there, and I have three crystals right there, authentic crystals. And I loaded it down. I got a pearl, a pearl right there. And I put like a little angel wing right there. And I love these little black and white beads. They came out of a Hobby Lobby. I made this like two months ago. Black onyx shell. It's just different. So I'm thinking about putting some type of design on this wood. That piece of wood. I think I am going to do some type of print on that wood. And that's just going to make it fire. But we're going to move on from that one. Okay. And we're going to go to this one. I made this one about a year ago also. And I'm like, okay, you made it. So, you know. This is authentic pearl on top, guys. And these little uh, flower pieces, you can't find these pieces anymore. Michael used to sell these pieces for about two to three years, but now they're not selling this, um, what do you call that? Bead. It's a bead, actually, any longer. And I can't remember the size of that bead, but I remember going in there sitting, and I'm like, well, let me see what I can do with these uh, cuffs and this bead. And I also used a spacer bead on top to set it all. Isn't that gorgeous? Different. And these earrings. I made these out of uh, memory wire. And I also used the bead. Isn't that gorgeous? So we're speeding through this, guys. I wanted to do a video and keep my content coming through. Another cuff bracelet. More Resin work, guys. I love uh, using this resin work with the gemstones. This is loaded down with uh, black onyx, quartz, key shavings, uh, silicone. I have all type of uh, different type of uh, gemstones in there. I can't think of all of them right now. And I used a copper butterfly because I thought that was so cute. That copper on the black, guys. This is more like a, one of those chi energy pieces. Also, one of those life force pieces. This 
one of a kind. You'll never see this anywhere, guys, on the market, unless I make it. If anybody else make it, it's not going to be the same. Beautiful heart. We're working with some heart energy this year. That's what my thing is, heart energy. Opening up that space of love around here. We don't care, you know, what color you are, what skin color you are. As long as you love him, we appreciate you, okay? <laughs> now, these beads, we let's get them real quickly. Selenite. This is um, gold flakes, and I have silver flakes in there. And I have a little bit of copper in there. All of these beads are handmade, guys. I made these beads, and I have like the little small two millimeter faceted bead in between. And I put a little copper in there also. Isn't that gorgeous. Let me try to stay in the frame. Nobody else has this on the market, guys. This is going on my website. And this is a tedious piece to make, especially with the uh, beads. So this would be like a special order. So when I put this one on my website, I'm going to say special order, guys. Look at that. Isn't that bead there? Gorgeous, gorgeous, gorgeous. Yeah, I say gorgeous because I love gorgeous jewelry. I love gorgeous. I love different. This is different. The beads are beautiful. Beautiful beads made by me. Loaded, loaded with goodies, goodies. Now, let me run it down this real quickly. These I bought a few years ago. So now Michaels have changed some of the uh, gemstones that they carry in here. Because the next item coming up, I will show you the how they have changed their uh, pieces. I mean, their gemstones out. They got the agate. They got the adventure ring, the quartz, tiger eye, magnetite. Magnetite is a powerful little stone. A lot of people don't know about the uh, magnetite. Adventure ring, more tiger eye, garnet, quartz crystals. I've uh, used all quartz crystals, magnetite, and the onyx. Like I said, I used the onyx on this. So let's get into this so I can... Um, Get on through with this video. I do not want to be out the frame. So I can't remember. When I went back and review it. If I needed to put it here or here. Oh, I hope this is in the frame. If not, I have to do this video over, guys. But it's showing up. So we're going to leave it like this, okay? Now. Can you say 1970s? Can anybody say, I think I got to put it closer to me. Can anyone say 1970? And T. Guys, we're going to take them off. Would you believe These stones in here, I put these stones in here, guys. Isn't that gorgeous? Look at the presentation. And I'm going to run through them very quickly and I'll share with you the different gemstone meeting, meanings. Like the rose quartz, love, heart, generosity, receiving, good energy, your life force, courage, enthusiasm. Guys balance, balancing of the energy. So we're going to put that back on that one, okay? And like I said, they, ruby, they're using the garnet, but this is pure ruby right here. I, like I said, when I bought these about four or five years ago, they had the ruby in there. Now, these are authentic stones, guys. That is a ruby. And the ruby is life force, courage, Positive strength. Okay, I read that for the rose quartz. A little bit, you know, similar. Root chakra. Balance your foundation on that one. Also, I sure hope I'm not out the frame. Amethyst, guys. Amethyst is a powerful stone also. 
The amethyst is for courage, manifestation, strength also, guys. Love also, beautiful. Amethyst also can be used for um, money drawing, so they say. This one is my birthstone. This is the peridot. This is uh, increase in prosperity, well-being, stone of the earth. And a long time ago, this stone was used in um, energy of uh, royalty, guys. Okay. Blue topaz stone. Also, guys. Blue topaz is enhancement of the mind. This stone works with the throat chakra, the fifth chakra, and the third chakra, guys. Also. And the last one is citrine. Manifestation, personal well-being, and mental clarity, guys. This also works with the uh, solar plexus. So... Anyway, guys, I just want to come back, and I hope this one is a good video, and it's 11 minutes in there. And that, let's go back to the amethyst, guys. The amethyst is for uh, purification, divine connection, and release of addiction. That's the uh, purple stone. It's just a form of quartz, guys. So we're going to put that there. I hope it's in the frame. Then we're just going to move it about a little bit so we can make sure that, you know, you can see this. But thank you guys for coming to my channel. I want to get this quickly because my battery is about phase, is about to go out. And I, th I hope this is a good video, even though I was rushing to see, you know, showcase different. I'm about uh, different. I'm about creating um, different pieces, guys. Doing something, you know, out of the box. Not, not the norm. I love this. <laughs> I love this. And this is an elegant piece right there, guys. Very, to me, very elegant. And we'll put the little earrings in here since I mentioned the earrings. Also, guys. And like the, and tomorrow I'm gonna come back and share this with you guys. Beautiful, beautiful. We talking chain links tomorrow, okay? And we you know, we're gonna be dealing with the gold element tomorrow. How about that? So guys. Like and share if you choose to, and if you have a uh, your friends that you think might be interested, you know, tell them about Sunbun Creations on YouTube. My channel is gaining viewers, and I, you know, truly, truly, truly appreciate that, guys. But thank you, and I hope uh, you see something in here that interests you, or something that you might like to give you some ideas. It's all about moving forward and stepping out of the box, guys, and doing your own thing. It's not about the norm. That You know, the norm is 1920, 1930, 1940, 1950. The old stuff, it ain't about that no more. We in 2023, baby. We in a new cycle. And we in here hand-painting beads. Me and Miss Darlene. We are in here creating our own designs, creating our own colors, hand painting beads. I know me, Miss Darlene. I don't know about anybody else on, you know, YouTube. But right now, that's what we're doing. And I'm here making my own beads because I know the size beads I want and I know what I want to put in my beads, guys. I do Argon Chi Energy beads. I'm here to help. I'm here to help us heal this earth, guys. That's what I do. That's why I work with these uh, gemstones. And I like to turn my uh, energy pieces into fabulous pieces. 
I can see white t-shirts. Everything on here you can wear with a white t-shirt and jeans or shorts, you know, for the summer. Jeans for the winter, guys. T-shirts. T-shirt. White t-shirts, guys. But anyway, thank you. Thank you for coming and come again, please. See you in the next video, which will probably be tomorrow. Thank you. Blessings.